And we're ready for the first of a scheduled 10 round super middleweight bout here between Jaylon Love and Deshaun Johnson. And there's Bell for the first round. Love in these white and black trunks. And Johnson in the gray trunks with the black trim. And Love comes in 22 and 1 with 12 knockouts. As there you see Johnson let go of the right hand. And Johnson. 21-19 and three Austin. You don't ever want to adjust somebody just looking at the numbers. You, know, you want to see what he got. And in this round, you know, right now, he's being the aggressive. He stabs in a jab. Good fill out round for both fighters. Well, Johnson, uh, six and one in his last seven, to your point. So at the period, though, from February of 2012 to January of 2015, so roughly three years, he went 4, 16, and 1. Wow. So he has since uh, turned things around, lands there with the overhand right. And now Love gets it. Love, meanwhile, 4-0 oh in his last four fights. His last and only loss came five fights ago to Rogelio Medina. In August of 2014, just over two years ago. And he makes no excuses. He was dropped by Medina in the third round, not the conscious. And says that was a huge learning experience. Johnson comes in. Well, I'll tell you, Stop. you know, you learn more Break. from a loss than you learn from 50 wins. Break. You know, you step does back. show you what you need to work on, and what kind of holes in the game you need to patch up. Good left there from Johnson and splits through the guard of Love. And now Love settles into plants. Some bad attention on that hook. I'll tell you what, Johnson, by the way, I know Love, check that. It's ripped. Yeah. yeah I mean, both these guys look like they're in shape. I mean, hand this guy a football out of the backfield, <laughs> and he's going to hurt some. Uh, Defensive backs, a safety coming down to crack down and make the tackle. <laughs> Jelly on love. And Deshaun Johnson here in round one to schedule 10. Both fighters will drop the first round. You know, we got 10 of them together, so. Looks like Johnson could have been ranked as the last. Holding! Holding! Stop! Jay Nanny, the Warren's love. Hey, let's chill out on the early holding. As round one comes to a close, you know what? Not a bad round for Deshaun Johnson. No, not at all. You know, he, he was busier, the aggressive. Uh, even going to win the state, he took that round. Yeah, Johnson doing a little bit of work here. All right, back for more PBC the next round on Bounce after this. Back here on PBC the next round on Bounce TV, round two of a scheduled 10 rounder here. Jaylon Love going up against Deshaun Johnson. And Johnson had a, a very nice open round. And both guys helped each other out a little bit to end the first round. Love got into the sport when he was about 14 years of age. He's from the Detroit area and said he was doing too much fighting in the street. So he was eventually brought there to the legendary Croc Gym in Detroit to get some of his aggression out. And there he ended up working with the late great uh, Emmanuel Stewart. His mom was not, she was not down with him getting involved in boxing until she found out that he showed up at Kronk. And then she offered 100% support. It worked out well. A great angle for him. About 100 fights. Ah! It was a part of all the Oh. Big competitions, 2009 National Golden Glove Championships, 2008 Golden Glove Championships, so uh, 2007 as well. It's a good amateur experience. Yep. Yeah. 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 One thing about Deshaun Johnson, though, is he's actually an MMA fighter. He's, he has a record of nine wins uh, against two losses. Much better than his boxing record, but you know, he's yeah. an all around fighter. <laughs> Well, that could explain a little bit of the awkwardness that he does his punches. 
Yeah, a little wide uh, from Gallatin. But those are hard to get away from, the ones that, that you're not used to ducking, you know? And now Love's starting to get comfortable releasing his jab. You saw a double jab there. Another overhand right from Johnson. Leaping shot. Stop! Oh, oh, well, while he's tied up, Johnson actually doing the right thing. Yeah. Continues to go to work. Yeah, I, I wish Jalen would stop holding, or holding as much and let his hands go as well. Because he, you know, he's, he's getting out work. Oh, oh nice hook. Yeah, hook short. Oh, oh and Johnson yeah. comes back. Another hook, though, from Love. So Love with a couple of counter hooks. Working that perimeter. Uh, Sean needs to get in there and kind of cut the ring off and keep the shot. He's just sitting there. Yeah, well, Love certainly getting looser here with the jab. Seen four unanswered jabs here. Make that five. That's right. Overhand right from Johnson. Another looping shot. So, better round two here for Love. To give Johnson credit, continues to get his extra. Nice right hand oh, oh, oh. round for Love. Back here is to get set for round three of a scheduled 10 rounder. So, a okay. little bit of flurry. Come on, get this clean up. At the end of the second round, Austin. Hey, Joe. Yeah, good little hook he jumped in with. And then, you know, he missed the majority of the spikes, but that, you know, that one hook, I think, did some damage. Yeah, first one got through, and that was a little bit wild there with the, the last few here. Johnson, he's been down just three times in his career. Again, we told you he's 21, 19, and three. Had a spell there, he was, he was 16 and one, 2012, 2015. But, uh, look, he's been knocked down by, I mean, these guys are in the slots. You got Sergio Moore in here. Also, Michael Anderson, uh, Julian Williams. And both of whom were undefeated at the time. So, and Williams obviously now top super welterweight contender. His next fight's going to be for a world title. So, Johnson, and he's been in with some of the bigger names in the sport. A bit of deceptive record. Because, you know, he is, he's much better than the numbers show. You know, he's, he is giving James a little bit of problem. You know, that's why he's in here in the ring tonight here. And we mentioned Love is from the Detroit area, from Inkster, but he makes his home here in Las Vegas now. Has some support and stance. Stop! Break! Good to Sean Johnson. What, what is your Watch. fight need to be? Well, he seems to have more success when he's inside, let his hands go. Um, I think he, he's smuggling himself a little bit. He needs to check his distance. That way he can be more effective in his punches. Um, of course, he can take up the shots, which will land more. I think on the button if he, he did. Had a, had a lead off his left hook there, and then was, was wide with a couple of shots, but it looked like he got the attention of him. If you love, by the way, stop. How do you stop the onslaught where, where Johnson just kind of plunges in and then and he gets a little wide? I, you know, a, a crisp jab. I meet him with the jab every time he jumps in. You know, even you meet him with the right hand. He's going to have to get his respect to make him stop walking in on him or jumping in on him. Just... Love gets off first with the jab. But Johnson doesn't back away. Look at the size difference, by the way. I mean, I, I know we're talking about Super Bowl. I mean, <laughs> Love looks like he's got him by about 15, 20 pounds. It's that rehydration. <laughs> but we haven't necessarily seen that translate so far inside the ring. Jaleon needs, needs to be more busy. You know, uh, Johnson's out with nothing else. He's out working. Tricky early rounds to score here. Johnson held, but continues to do work through three. 
So boom, boom, touch, stab him now there. Stab, get pull, pull, but you're gonna pull the pull all out. And then, and gonna be the jab. Like, you know, this guy's just walking in on him. He's gonna have to meet him with a crisp, solid jab. As you see him working the perimeter and pumping that jab out, it's keeping him off of him. Well, I wanted to lay out there, and we came back uh, from commercial just to hear Theo Chambers, uh, who's the head trainer for Jamie on Love, because he was giving instructions. And it's something that we talked about earlier, which is the jab's been good, but just need to see more. Yeah, exactly. And, and really, throw it hard. You know, and sometimes he just paws it out there, and that's when Deshaun really walks in on it. And when he throws a nice, hard, crisp jab, it stops him in the tracks. Round four of a scheduled 10 round in here. Super middleweight affair. Jalen on love, 22 and one. Going up against Deshaun Johnson. All right, a look here at Austin's unofficial scorecard. What do you got, Big Phil? Well, 29, 28, Johnson, I got two more than one. Uh, just because of his work rate. He, he's, you know, he's outworking Jalen. Uh, no one's really hit each other with, with devastating shots quite yet, but he's definitely outworking him. Johnson, when you, when you take a look at his records, oh, it's, it's a good point you made earlier about records can be deceiving. 22 and 1, 12 knockouts. He has been down four times yeah. in his career as Johnson lets his hands go. I mean, he's only human. <laughs> could be why so Johnson tries to bust off the guard there. Love, but could be why maybe he's been a little, a little tentative so far. Deshaun Johnson so far has not the turf. He continues to walk down. Jalen Love. Jalen Love in the white and black trunks. And Johnson, the fly boy, in the gray and black. Good footwork displayed by Jalen Love. Finally, a good body shot that time from Love. Haven't seen a lot of work in the body. I was going to say, I think that was the first body shot he's throwing. Nice right hand. Colin coming in. Met him with that right hand. As Johnson tried to jump in. Yeah, and startled Johnson. Yeah, yeah, Johnson's yeah. taking a little bit of time here. He has not thrown a punch since that right hand landed from Jalen on Love. And Johnson trying to gather himself, but still coming forward, but has not thrown a punch. This will be the time for Jalen to you know, take advantage of the, All right. Oh, there he goes. Take advantage of that, that pause in his offense to, to, you know, start his own offense. A little bit more speed on display here from Love and the fourth. The left hand from Johnson blocked by Love. Lead right hand from Johnson gets through. Shout no. out for Jaylen Love here in the fourth. That's you grabbing. Who landed the biggest punch of the fight so far. Good straight. And it was right, a right, right down the pipe. Let's listen in a little bit here in Johnson's corner. Jermaine Simpkins here. I think it stayed low enough trainer. on those slugouts to be able to get to his body. Especially if you go up top, bam, bam. Okay. Instead of keeping up to the head because he's slippery yeah, up there. Yeah, yeah. Mm -hmm. Foot, bam, bam. Okay, and sometimes be patient, but always be thinking. Every time his back touches this rope, you got to blast it. You got to be looking to knock him out every time he touches that rope. Okay? And make an attempt. Okay? Because his counters ain't coming back with a lot of power. All right, unless unless you can tell me otherwise. No, you're right. You're right. Okay. You're right. Okay. So when it's back awesome. to that, that, that's great advice. Buddy. That was a good we'll advice. We'll talk about yeah. that. Go ahead. This is a nice little onslaught from Johnson. Had Jaylion in the in the ropes. That's when he he does the best damage when Jaylion is up against the ropes. Here's a body blow from from Jaylion Love. Beautifully placed shot. It looked like it was partially deflected by the elbow. Simpkins did a great job though there. I mean, there were a number of points that he made. First off, make sure instead of you go head hunting up top, make sure you jab uh, towards that chest a little bit. And then he said when his back is up against the ropes, that's when you let your hands go because there's not a lot coming back. That's right. He says he's not going to power from off the counter. Stop! And again, that's where he does the best work. It's a home game for Jay Leon Love, and he's, he's getting plenty of advice. You're holding the crowd here at the Chelsea. 
Some anxious fans. But some anxious supporters here alive. This is a little bit too close for comfort. That is close. It is a close fight. No one's gotten the, the, the edge yet. Nice body shot that time from Johnson. It's, it's close primarily because Marvin is not so particularly active in what he's doing. He's, he's in good shape. Catches Johnson there with two good shots. Quick left from Johnson. Oh, nice left hook and a nice left jab from the top. This is a good time to go up and down. Body hit, body hit. That was his head. And that's pretty, been, pretty much been the direction of the whole fight. I mean, most of the damage and most of the target area. Stop, Love's targeted the head. Yeah, and, and the thing that just changes it up, it, it gives him Johnson something else to think about and worry about. So, okay, now the gun is going to And it's down a little bit. <laughs> yeah, because I mean, this guy, he's relentless. Hit it left here in the fifth. Nice jab that time for Love. Right hand from Jaleon Love. Nice, nice counter right hand. Keep the love is when Johnson is wild, he's got to make a pay because a lot of times it looks like he's off balance, right. out of position. And he's very vulnerable because of the way he punches, right? he throws everything into it. If you could time it and catch him while he's throwing. Love's had some good shots in this round. Don't hold it. And been go, go. a little holding, bit busier. And Johnson does a good job when he's held up. You were holding. Ten seconds left here in the fifth. Shot was blocked. Looked excited, but it was blocked by Love. All right, let's jump in on the blue corner here and listen don't to spill the God Theo damn Chambers. Just I don't, a little I don't bit. worry about it. Hey, no, I don't. Whatever you do, I, I, I'm going to bring your nose. Know. Yeah, bring your nose. Know. Kick these niggas out. Hey. Hey, Jay, man. Hey. No, I, hey. I saw that. Look, you, you, hey, listen. Listen, you, 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 you focus. I mean, let me, I'm, I'm, I'm going to handle that. Open my mouth. Okay, now listen, Jay. Now I'm just starting to touch the motherfucker, right? I'm just starting, I'm just getting right to the body. Okay. I'm just, I'm just, touch, 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 touch the right to the body, the, 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 put on left foot. Uh -huh. I'm gonna tell you something. What you, what, what you doing is, what you doing is let the motherfucker get too, you gotta be too close to you and, and then you'll start doing the jab. Yeah. Stop him before he even get, fuck it, so soon as okay. he move, right like, here with a faint, and then you go the other way, uh -huh. but, but, touch it, touch it, touch okay. it. Set the right hand up, pop, okay. pop, pop, boom. All yeah. right? Yeah. Deep breath, deep breath. Huh. Hey. Let's go, coach. Good advice again yeah. from uh, Theo Chambers here, basically trying okay. to get this fighter not forget about the body. Don't forget the body, okay. man. Up, you tell him to touch him up and down. And, and I think that will that will give him the edge. Right, because then you can come back upstairs. That's right. It's a chess match here. This lead to Johnson. Overhand right, it's wild, but it lands for Deshaun Johnson. That's the thing. I mean, these punches definitely looping. They love. They come from an angle that, that people aren't used to, you know? That's why it, it's, it's, it's hard to get away from. Oh. Nice big right hand from Love, and it stuns Johnson. Three, he catches four, him with an uppercut, five, and Johnson loses six, his balance. Seven, eight, no he's okay. I don't okay. know what he's complaining five. about. That punch <laughs> happened right in front of us, and now Love goes to work. Johnson definitely in trouble. No more, no more, no more, no more, no more, no more. So, Jamie on Love comes up with no a big shot here in the sixth round. To finish Deshaun Johnson, and Johnson, he's incredulous. What? Disagrees with the stoppage, says he was fine, but Johnson was not firing back, and Jay Maney made a what decision. The? It was what a good happened? stoppage. He, he was taking some very good cool shots, and he, was, he never, he never got better from that first round. He, he never recovered. I love trying to give a little dap there to Johnson. Johnson wanted no part of it. Another look. And this is what happens when you keep coming in, and he came in low, and he got cracked with an uppercut. 
Beautifully placed. This is another angle of that shot. Good stop. What was Johnson complaining about? Was he, I mean, no, it's, it, it wasn't like Love stepped on his foot or anything. He just got pummeled with a right uppercut right there. That was great. Right I don't know what he said there. But, but I don't think he was, you know, he doesn't understand what was going on. And the, and the beautiful work here by Love. I mean, Nady really had, Jermaine, what are you had no about? choice because Johnson was What are you not, doing? Wasn't, well, and it wasn't well, even the ref, it was, the, it was his corner that threw the towel. You know me better than anyone. It was a good stop. Was, you know, they, now he's able to, you know, live and fight another day. Sean Johnson was game, but uh, let's send it over to Ray Flores now for the official particular. Ladies and gentlemen, the end comes at 53 seconds of the sixth round for your winner by technical knockout, Jay Leon Jay Leon Love improves to 23-1 with a spectacular six-round knockout of Deshaun Johnson.